bowl games for junior college football teams were announced, and RCTC's football team, ranked two in the nation, was set to match up against number one team. But that game was not set in stone and was the only game left to be announced. ABC 6 News reporter Ben Henry has details on why there was a delay. This just one of many touchdowns scored from the Yellow Jackets on their way to a perfect 11 and 0 season. We got a team and we got a family, so I like our chances, and we're just going to go down there and give it everything we got. Thursday, the school officially announced its intention to travel to Mississippi to play for a national championship. The announcement came a couple days later than expected, leaving uncertainty of its plans and why the announcement had to wait. We knew that there was going to be a positive result, so we were just waiting patiently for our time to announce it, and, and uh, we are very thankful and grateful for the opportunity. We didn't ever have any thoughts of not playing in the bowl game, but we do have to sign contracts, and as we were going through the contract language, that's something that we have to submit to our legal representatives for the Minsky system to make sure that every part of that is agreeable with our legal department and the AG's office. So that was the delay. President McClellan said it boiled down to legalities and making sure all sides were on the same page before making anything official for the biggest game of the season. A lot of that deals with the safety issues and concerns that we have in a team traveling, and we just wanted to make sure that we had the best interests of our students in mind. McClellan mentioned it didn't have to do with the funding. The school is possibly facing its second championship in the same year and has reserved funds for occasions like this that the student life department is in charge of. We have championship teams. We know we need to fund that and uh, be ready for that. So we're excited that we can have those opportunities. An opportunity towards a perfect season. The resiliency of this football team is, is unmeasurable. In Rochester, Ben Henry, ABC 6 News. And the Yellow Jackets will be playing for the NJCAA Championship against Northwest Mississippi Community College in Biloxi, Mississippi. It will be on December 6th.